We started the third session um, on, a, on a used rear tyre and uh, I said to the guys I want to do one lap on a used rear tyre and then come in and we'll put a new one in and see where we're at and what we need to do. I done my lap, came in with a 45.5, which I thought was, was, was okay. And then uh, I said, right, who's done what? And they said, Keo's done a 45.1. I was like, you're flipping joking. And uh, yeah, that's that kind of set the precedent. And I went out and uh, done two or three 45.1s, but uh, it was nice to do a 45.1, but it would have been even nicer to do a 44. But uh, I think everybody's pretty much on the edge there and uh, I'll take pole, whatever it is. <laughs> We're off and the, the, the power goes down and the two HM plant Hondas veer for the inside line and it's Shaky who gets it. Swooping imperious line of Shaky Burns inviting some uh, threat from the inside. Oh, DMN! And suddenly we've got... Oh, and Shaky Burn has been, been completely right unsettled and he's on pushed the right onto the dirt. Oh, oh, someone's gone down huge. Suddenly Shaky Burn has space to play with. Shaky Burn on the HM plant Honda has survived all the shenanigans around him to take victory at the 1.2 mile circuit here at Brands Hatch Indy. That was pretty good, I'm happy enough with that. We had a bit of a sort of incident pack race really, but um, when Stuart came past and the race got restarted, I knew that I had to quite get past Stuart as quick as possible and hope that he kind of hold everyone up so I could make a bit of a break and fortunately it panned out. But uh, you know, I know Tommy was coming back through and he would have been you know, real strong for sure, but uh, we'll take each win however they come. <laughs>